a little-known feature that was snuck in for Creative Cloud members and subscribers in CS6 was the ability to copy the CSS from your layers. So the position, the font, the size, the style. So if I were to go to Products, for example, and right-click on the layer in the Layers panel, I can copy the cascading style sheet for the web developer. If I switch to any text editor and choose Edit, Paste, there is a class definition of products with the font size, family, transformations, even position. But wait, there's more. If I delete that and grab the whole top nav, which includes the logo and all of these pieces of text and the cart icon, I could right-click on that copy CSS, come back over and paste. And we've got the cart, the cart icon, the login or join, the adventure sports. It's astounding how much can be ported over and reused when you go to code the website. This is just the beginning of some more of the integration to get your web mockups out of Photoshop and delivered to your web developer so you get more exact positioning, and proper font, sizes, styles, and colors. And if I were to take all of these layers and collapse them and build one new master layer group called the Pluralist and put them all inside, I don't really need the white background as part of that because I could specify that in the definition. I could select the Pluralist, right-click, copy CSS, come back over, delete that. Once I cleared it all out with the pluralist as the parent, I can now paste and look at all of this detail for every individual layer, every individual object. That brings me to a power user trick. So Photoshop expanded every layer and every layer subgroup. So now if I wanted to see just one individual group, my power user trick is to hold down Option or Alt, click the eye icon, and I can see what's on top nav. Collapse it, hold down Option or Alt, click the eye icon, and see what's on top image. This is immensely useful when you dissect someone else's work. If I scroll down a little bit, I can hold down Option or Alt and see what's on Shop by Category. It's very tricky to see, but it's right there. But the goal with this exercise was to show you the massively powerful ability to select a layer, right-click, and copy the CSS for the positioning, font, size, style, and color of that layer.